All right, so MIUI 13 is here. We've had a couple of videos on that particular topic. It looks beautiful, it looks exciting, and a lot of content is yet to come. Now in today's video, we're going to talk about how to install the latest MIUI 13 pre-beta. The reason I say it pre-beta is because these are alpha builds. These are not meant for daily usage. They will have a bunch of you know bugs. For example, if you saw my MIUI 13 video, on the Mi 11X, it doesn't have always on display working and a few things like the camera keeps crashing when you try to click a picture. So this by no means are daily driver builds, but if you're excited, if you want to try MIUI 13 and your device is amongst the devices which have, you know, made it to the list wherein you will get a MIUI 13 alpha build, you can go ahead and follow this guide. Now remember for different devices, the recovery will be different and the ROM will be different. And as in when I keep getting access to different files, I'll keep adding those in the list at the description. So in today's video, we're going to follow the steps for the Mi 11X in which I have a special version of the recovery, which allows you to flash Android 12 based MIUI 13 beta. And uh, yeah, it should be working fine because I tried it yesterday and it was doing great. We are on MIUI 12.5.7. So before we get into the details, well, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell icon because it doesn't cost you anything. And it really motivates us to make amazing content like this. If you think you like chatting with like-minded people, join us on Telegram. We have more than 1500 people over there. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And last but not the least, if you think the hard work is worth the effort, please click on the join button and support the channel. Now, without further ado, Hello awesome people, welcome to Phone Ops. My name is Kalash, let's get going. So I'm on an unlocked bootloader. I have more than 50% battery. I have backed up all the information. Now these are three very important things that you need to take care of. You need to have an unlocked bootloader. You need to have a specific version of TWRP installed. How to install TWRP? Video is linked in the description. Follow that guide, but use the TWRP file linked in this description, okay? And what was the third thing? Back up all your data, right? Make sure your data is backed up because we are going to do a format data without which a you know, smooth experience will not be possible on MIUI 13. At the same time, make sure you have more than 50% battery because this file that we are going to flash is a pre-beta and it is around four and a half gigabytes. So it will take like at least five to seven minutes to flash and then it is it is a very, very early build. There are no risk as such. I've flashed it twice by now, but huge disclaimer, do it at your own risk. You're doing something that is not officially supported by Xiaomi. So give it a try, nothing to worry there. Now, once you've taken care of all of those, you need to make sure that you don't have any Google account, any MI account signed in your lock screen security, everything is removed, like the face unlock and everything is removed and reboot your device once. Once you've taken care of all of those, there is just one file that you need to flash considering that you are on the TWRP that is suggested in the description mentioned below, right? Now in my case, I'm using a OTG pen drive just to be safe because you know, sometimes you get stuck. So if you go to the file manager over here and say, let's look for our OTG pen drive, as you can see, USB storage connected. The name of the file itself is MIUI Elliot Pre 21.12.27 based on Android 12, right? It doesn't even mention MIUI 13 as yet. So the betas will have MIUI 13 mentioned on them. Now, once you've done that and once everything is ready as mentioned, let's go to reboot and press and hold volume up and power. Now, there are a lot of DFEs and other things floating around for this MIUI 13 build. I would not suggest you to use that because I've seen people having issues with the EFS partition, which can actually revoke your IMEI and warranty both, and you will not be able to use the SIM card in that. Anyways, once you've booted into this recovery, right, go to wipe, go to advanced wipe, Dalvik, data. You can wipe internal storage if you don't have the file there. If you have the file there, don't wipe internal storage. Okay, wiped everything. Now go to install, select storage, select the OTG pen drive. You see this particular file over here? Select this, disable auto reboot after update, skip digest check before installing, right? Automatically reflash TWRP after flashing the ROM, okay? And uncheck reboot installation. Reboot after installation is complete, swipe to confirm flash. Now, as I said, this is a huge ROM, four and a half gigabytes. So it will take some time to flash. So please, you know, probably have a coffee or do something step away and leave this phone alone for five to seven minutes. Let it flash. Let's wait for the flashing to complete and then we will see what are the next steps that we have to follow. All right, now as you can look at the screen, the flash has completed, right? As you can see, updating partition details. There are a bunch of errors. Now don't worry, 
these are the errors that I had encountered earlier, earlier as well. So go to wipe, format data and type in yes. Reboot system. It will say no OS installed. Are you sure? Okay, yes. So swipe to confirm flash and wait for the MI boot logo. This is the splash screen. This is not the boot logo. Wait for the MI, MI UI boot logo, which will make that weird sound. Remember introduced with MI UI 12.5. There you have it. That means we flashed it just fine and we are going to boot into MIUI 13 just fine. Now let's wait for the boot to complete. This is MIUI we are talking about. It will take about one to two minutes to boot for the first time. So please be patient while that happens. All right, so as you can see, just like that, we have booted into MIUI 13 and we will select English. That is an option. Luckily, that means we can use this ROM. So I'm quickly going to skip through all the options and I'm going to show you that we are indeed on MIUI 13. So skipping on this doesn't really take a lot of time because I was not signed into MI account. So MI AI that is artificial in intelligence and stuff like that. Setup complete. You have the beautiful wallpaper. So let's see here. Settings. My device and then all specifications as you can see this is android version 12 with the android 12 easter egg doing a great job and then this is a mi 11x 6 plus 2 gb extended ram the octa core info is incorrect the processor info but this is the miui 13 latest beta so that's it guys that's the latest step-by-step -step guide to install miui 13 right you're done not really now, there is one thing though, you will notice over here that if you go to display, you don't really have a refresh rate option. So what you need to do is you need to go to my device. Okay. Go to all specs, go to MIUI version, keep tapping it. Okay. You are a developer now. So go to developer options under additional settings. Okay. Now first enable the option called show refresh rate over here. So we can see what refresh rate we are running at. Otherwise, the phone will feel very laggy, which it does in, I mean, it doesn't feel laggy, but it doesn't feel that smooth as it should be. Scroll all the way to the bottom after enabling refresh rate and turn off MIUI optimization. You will get this prompt. Wait for five seconds and then go ahead and hit accept. Okay, bam, 120 is working. You can go ahead and, you know, enable MIUI optimization again. It will again give you a prompt. Three, two, one, wait, accept, cancel. Cancel, turn on, there you go. So now you have 120 Hertz with MIUI 13. Now, one last tip for you guys, you can go to the pinch menu and you can uninstall a bunch of bloatware over here, which you will not use if you're not from China. So yes, you can de-bloat it. And one last thing that I need to mention here is something like get apps. You will have a feature called or an app called get apps over here, this one. So if you want Google Play Store, you don't need to worry a lot. What you need to do is you need to connect to the internet and search for Play Store over here from Get Apps. You can go ahead and install the Play Store as well. So you will debloat your MIUI 13, you will get 120 Hertz working and you will be able to get Play Services in Play Store with your contacts and sync and everything else as well. So this is a complete, now this is a complete step-by-step -step guide to install and use MIUI 13 on your Mi 11X or any Xiaomi device that is supported initially. Let me know in the comment section what do you think about this video. Until the next one, this is Kailash signing off at PhoneOps. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.